Hi, I'm Rob Stocklosa, Application Engineer with TPM out of Raleigh, North Carolina. Today we're going to talk about interfacing our SOLIDWORKS electrical program into our PDM environment. Uh, many of you may have noticed we have a button up under our tools pull down here that links directly into the PDM uh, program, and we're going to look at that in a minute. However, I want to show you a couple alternate methods. Uh, the first uh, is a tr more traditional process where we just take a title block, uh, apply a revision area, and categorize our revisions through that way. Our second option is to use the incorporated revision tool located within a right click uh, of each scheme that you create within electrical. So today we're going to go ahead and just check off that we looked over this particular revision. I'm going to verify uh, that it was done correctly and we'll just tidy up Freddie's work and put in a little description for him here. So this is another option that you have um, and again it's it's a more traditional method where each uh, scheme or each uh, sub area that we have has a revision area that we can categorize and keep track of. So the option for this route simply uh, allows you to go in there and really control the revisions for each particular area, each scheme. Now the second way that you can approach this is through using PDM and our tool that we have incorporated into the program. Uh, you do have two options here. One is to do a checkout, check-in procedure, and the other is to take more or less a snapshot uh, in time of your particular project. Uh, that can warrant some conversation, so make sure you understand which way is best for your application. I'm going to go ahead and select the vault that I want to attach into. Once I've done that, I can go ahead and access that vault, and you'll see the folder categories and all the stuff that our typical uh, manufacturing team might have access to. We have the same tabs along the bottom to gain understanding of you know, what this data is actually pertaining to, what version it's in, uh, things of that nature. So we'll go ahead and accept that. Um, one more thing I want to point out here is the folder name. Uh, many times when we're interfacing with PDM, the folder structures are built off an equation, and we have that capability here as well. So to maintain standards, uh, just keep that in mind. When you're exporting, you have the, the uh, options along the bottom here where you can explicitly tell it what we want to export, uh, what format, if there are formats available. Uh, so you don't have to dish out the entire project. You can export individual components. Uh, just keep in mind your workflow and managing those from a revision standpoint. I hope you find this helpful. Uh, please uh, reach out to us if you have any questions. We'll be glad to help. Have a great day.